What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Benjamin and this is where we do everything bougie on a budget. But today I decided I'm going to do something a lot different and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys all my bougie but yet not at all budgeted bags and wallets. You guys ready? Some of these things you might have seen before but I'm going to go into depth with a few of them. All right, so let's get started. Mm -hmm. First item at hand, you've seen this probably if you watched my go-to bags, my favorite bags. Um, it is this Louis Vuitton Speedy 20, no, this is a Speedy 35. And it is in the brown checkered pattern. I don't, there's a particular name for it, but I really don't actually know what it is so or I can't I know what it is Damier I, but I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right but anyways um, I'm not gonna get too much into this because I already went through it in my other video but I wanted to bring her back out just to show you guys that this is one of my favorite bougie bags um, the cost of this was probably eleven $1 hundred um, I bought this shoot in 2016 it's in great condition um, I don't personally use this all the time but uh, I bid and babysitting it but I'm gonna start using it a lot more this year so isn't she pretty <laughs> so the next item at hand is my actual very 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 first Louis Vuitton um, and it's still in its box And I absolutely love this wallet, but I haven't been using it in a long time just because I found something out. Now that I'm getting older and I, for some reason I'm carrying more things, I was like, all right. It is this Louis Vuitton coin purse, coin wallet, coin purse, something like that, which is great because it has a lot of space and a lot of room. Um, this is the first wallet that my boyfriend ever bought me. And my first ever Louis Vuitton, like, real Louis Vuitton. Um, I think this was about $350, $340 or something at that time. Um, it's a little dirty, it's been used. I need to learn how to get that cleaned up. But yeah, definitely one of my favorites of all time. Next bag, or no, this is a wallet. And this one, you might have seen already in my whole Michael Kors collection, but I thought I'd bring it out again because this is the one that I'm not selling. This is the one that I have decided to just keep, and it is a gold metallic wallet. One of the reasons why I actually will not give this away is because one, it's just really freaking pretty. Two, it's the way that it opens. It's almost like a booklet in a sense, you know what I mean? And I can actually fit my cell phone in here if I don't put too many things in it maybe I can yes I can <laughs> but yeah I really love it and um, this this I like to take with me when I'm traveling um, because it can hold passports it can hold cash flow thing plenty enough room for cards cash ID it's perfect and it's beautiful it is absolutely just gorgeous that I had um, I bought this a long time ago. I don't remember if I got this at the outlet or at the Fashion Valley Mall, but it is a coach wallet. <clears throat> it is a coach wallet, excuse me. Um, and it is metallic, shiny and shimmery, and it's actually really pretty. It opens up in here. There is room for cards in here as well. This one I might be selling. Actually, I might be selling this one. Don't know yet because I haven't really used this ever. So, yeah, I still have to create my page for on eBay for where I'm selling my things. Um, all of the wallets from Michael Kors, and now this. I thought I was gonna get it done, but life. Next bougie item that I have is this. <clears throat> is my Tom Ford, I don't know what they call this, but I'm calling it the Tom Ford Bumblebee Sunglasses. 
in like a yellowish tint with a super, super dark lens. Um, I have never found the right moment to actually wear these sunglasses ever. I feel like they're just so like bumblebee, like I'm bug eyed that I'm like, can I pull this off? The answer is probably not. Um, plus it's yellow. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the tint of this is like a yellowish green. And I'm like, how? Why? First of all, why did I buy this? And it comes with its little case. Tom Ford case. Um, I spent, I spent a good amount of money on this bitch. I don't remember how much. This was a while back. I think I spent about 400, 500? A while back. Yeah. This is one of those purchases where it's like, why did you do that? Like, and you don't even wear it. I've barely ever, ever worn this. Don't, 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 don't bother me. I can't be bothered. So, the next item at hand is, <clears throat> okay. It is a pair of Prada sunglasses. I was, I did not buy this, but I thought I would bring it up. Uh, this was a present from my fabulous, fabulous sister. And it is these black aviators. This, now I wear this all the time now. I used to not want to wear it only because I was like, oh my God, another, I don't, I get, I get really nervous to wear expensive things because especially expensive sunglasses, excuse me, expensive sunglasses only because I feel like knowing me, this will drop, this will scratch, this will be lost, I will put it down somewhere and that's it, done. And the fact that it was a present, uh, if I had bought it, I only have myself to blame and if I, well, obviously, like, I can't, well, I'm not blaming anybody if I lost it myself, but if I bought it myself, then, like, fuck it, you know? But I would feel guilty if some, that if these were to get lost because these are a present. Presents mean more to me than my own, like, whatever, buying, whatever. So, I love them. Can be pretty cool, pretty chic. And what I love about these is that I can wear this throughout the entire year. There's no, like, you know, winter vibes, summer vibes, spring, fall, whatever. This can be worn on an everyday basis. On an everyday basis. Now, the next item I have is another pair of sunglasses and they are from Burberry. Now I bought these a long time ago when I used to have a job. <laughs> no, I do have a job. When I used to work at Sunglass Hut, I bought these sunglasses a long time ago and I was like never giving these away. These are Burberry sunglasses. Oh, it's so, well, it's like right there. These, I don't know, I don't, please don't ask. I think these were about at least $200, $300. With a discount, mind you, because again, I bought this when I was working there. I love these. These, bi gradient lenses, very lightweight. So when I say bi gradient lenses, what you can see is a, it's like dark at the top, light at the bottom. Perfect for bright, bright weather because it actually cools down the lighting for you. Look at me working at, look at me working at sunglass hat again right now. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I definitely love these sunglasses. Very classy. If I'm looking for a chic moment or, you know, whatever, definitely not gonna bust out with these Tom Fords, but I would definitely bring out my Burberry sunglasses. And I have kept these for years and in great condition. Let me see, can you guys see if I do this? Let's see, let's see. can you see the bi-gradient? Is it bi-gradient? There you go, that's awesome! Do you guys see that? So that's what I'm looking at. Um, and that's why I love these. In the summertime, this is great. Actually, I think these lenses are also really, really good. These kinds of lenses, the bi-gradient lenses, are really good for when you're over there. Wait. Um, on a cloudy day because it helps to brighten things up there too. So, love them. The thing that I want to show you is this little wallet that my mom got for me when she bought it in Italy for me 
as a little Italiano presente. Oh, no, I don't know if that was right. But um, it's this Louis Vuitton coin wallet. And it's the first Louis Vuitton my mom ever bought me and probably the last. Very spacious, very roomy, super cute, nice leather. Had this for years. Um, I don't put any coins in here, but what I do put is my, uh, when I go traveling, I take my rosary with me everywhere I go and I leave this, I leave the rosary in here and put it in my bag. So it's like a little case, you know. Jesus needs Louis Vuitton too. Okay, sure. Okay. Wait. That's it for this video. I think this is going to be a pretty short video. Um, just a quick look at some of the few bougie things that I've got that are not budgeted. And I, you know, sorry. But I thought I should show them to you because the fuck why not anyway with that said i hope that you guys like this video please like and subscribe um and i will see you guys in my next video bye bye guys thanks